everyone, Rosie and I have got a doll haul for you today. We've got quite a few dolls to show you. Most of them are from eBay. In fact, I think all of them are from eBay. Do you want to show yours first, Rosie? Nima got this one for you, didn't she? Because yeah. you didn't have it. I yeah. saw her for a good price on eBay and she's got most of her pieces with her. Yeah. Um, well, she's dressed and she's got her jewellery. Yeah. Um, and Rosie didn't have her and you, you liked her, so I let you have her, didn't I? I did yeah. buy her with Rosie in mind, actually, but... Uh, yeah, because I do already have her. Show her boots, Babs. She's got um, like yellow boots with like a darker, almost brown um, sole with a black bit that it, I think it's like one of those that go round but it's got a slit and then goes to there. And then she's got the laces with green socks. She's got some shorts with a little big button. She's got her like really light blue jacket with like pink and orange flying on it. And she's got her earrings. She's got a see-through necklace there, it's a chocolate and then she's got that necklace. And I told you about the top bit. So that's Rosie's doll. And then I got these two dolls. I bought them from the same seller. This one is a, now let's see, let me read the label. Modern Circle Producer Barbie from 2003. Now I did pay 35 pounds for her, but I had my eye on her for a long time. And I do really love her. Look at her face. She's got orange hair. And I've put her in this brand new outfit that was sent to me by my lovely friend Trevor. Um, she has got shoes to match. Yeah, the outfit came on a card and I think it suits her really well. Looks really good on her. She's got like these uh, short trousers, three quarter trousers, and then she's got these orange trainers. They do keep falling off the trainers do, but uh, maybe a bit of blue tack or something will hold those in place. Do you want to show that one? Yeah. And then she is a, it says you need her on her head and Dollykin, Dollykin USA on her back. But she's described as a vintage action girl doll and I paid 25 for her. She's very well articulated. She's um, really, really <laughs> well articulated. She came in this outfit, love this top, her hair is like a strawberry blonde, here's her face, yeah I loved her because she looked vintage, I love dolls that look vintage or in fact are vintage, that's her, and then I got this, are you going to show that one, yeah. this tiny little pullet doll. She was a really good price. I found her on eBay. I think I paid £20 for her. She really was a really good price. And she's brand new in her box look. She's lovely, isn't she? So she's my first... Well, I've got some... Now, what do you call them? BB dolls that look a bit like pull-ups. But um, she's called Vivi. It says Vivi... Uh, and I can't read the rest because it's all it? Chinese. Oh, yeah. yeah, but it does say ages 15 and up. And it does say pull it there. Now, I don't know whether that means she's a genuine one or not. But anyway, I was thrilled with her for the price. I think she's just so cute. I may take her out so I can free her hair oh. and put her on a stand and everything. Rose is excited to take her out, aren't you, Rosie? And then next I got this girl. Christy. Yep, yeah, she is Bubble Fairy Christy, still in her box. And she was a really good price too. I, I couldn't resist her for the price. So she's still got her wand with her. She has a wand on each hand and she spins around. You can see on the back. I think I've got the Bubble Fairy Barbie as well, but not with the bubble one still on her hands and you can get is that Teresa as well so you can yeah. get three different ones um a bubble solution 
friend of Barbie, Christy. Uh, dip her wand, pull the cord, and bubble fairy Christy spins. Yeah, so she comes with a, a pull cord, and it looks like she, yeah, there is some bubble solution there. I'm seeing if I can find a date on the box. Oh, 1998. Wow, so it's about 24 years old then. Yeah, so I was really thrilled to get her new in the box. I do love a Christy. Next I got these. I've actually had these for a while, but I've lost them. Well, I hadn't lost them. I'd just forgotten about them, to be honest. Oh. And they are Ariel Sisters. Um, I don't know what the names are, but look at these. They're little tiny dolls. These are them next to the Barbie. You can see they come up to Barbie's way. So what are they, six inches? So we've got, I think there's one missing, but you can put them in your bath. They're, um, they've got like a rubbery. I think she's got some sisters. Yeah, so there is some missing. And they do have little marks on them like this. I'm hoping that'll come off. But uh, I don't think that, oh, that tail does click. You can click it. So that was that one. We've got an orange one. We've got this one in the yellow. She's got black hair. They're really pretty, aren't they, actually? I do really like these. And then we've got this one with a purple suit on. And her hair's a bit shorter. Really pretty. And then we've got another orangey red one and she seems to have a little crown on she's a little blondie that one's pretty. yeah and then this one which is not the same colors as ariel but similar yeah she, her head looks as if it's too far down on her body yeah, that one's like Ariel's. yeah there we are look is it all right now her head yeah she's got a little fire and then there. we also got ariel so yeah got ariel and five of her sisters Rosie said there should be seven sisters, so it looks like we're seven missing two. Yeah, I think, it, I'm sure the seller said that there was one missing. And they weren't very expensive, but I thought they were cute little dolls. Yeah. And uh, I was pleased to have them. I don't think you can sit them down. No, this is as, they won't bend any further than that. So, yeah, I'm not quite sure how I'm going to display them. But, yeah, I thought they were cute, a cute little set. And then I got a large bundle for £22. This is the first doll from that bundle. She is Barbie, it says Bridesmaid Barbie. She's got some cardboard flowers there and she's got that pink dress on. But a brand, well, a new unboxed Barbie. Um, she does have some little, she's got moulded on shoes. I don't know if you can see, but she's got like moulded on ballet type shoes by the look of them let's take her out shall we and have a look here we are she's a pretty doll she's got that lovely face mold her hair is so nice really nice quality that hair is and it's lovely she's got little tags in her yeah, in her head nice. still it does doesn't it and then she's got her like cerise bridesmaid dress on and her little cardboard bouquet there and as I say her shoes are like ballet shoes shoes but they're molded on. She does a little bit like Ed Sisters, does it? Like it, your dog's it hair. It's very soft it's isn't it? Yeah. She I think is Pocahontas's friend. I can't remember what her name is because I can never remember what Pocahontas's friend is called. Something like Nakoma or something like that but I'm not sure whether Nakoma is the boy, is it? Yeah. Pocahontas. I think that one's Pocahontas. You think this is Pocahontas, do you? Yeah. Oh, you could be right. She has, yeah. But I thought her friend had it as well. No. Oh, apparently this is Pocahontas. I've I got it round my neck. Mm. Rosie knows better than I do. So she's a Disney doll anyway. She's got a twisty waist, no articulation in her arms, and her arms are slightly bent. Um, bend and snap knees. There's no date on her head. It just says Disney, and she's wearing this, what does it say on her back? Oh, it's a Simba Disney doll, or maybe it is Pocahontas then. Ah, I didn't realise it was Sim Simba. Yeah, so she's a Simba Pocahontas, according to Rosie, and she probably knows better than I do, so we'll go with what she says. She's wearing a Discover the World with Barbie dress. 
so yeah that's actually a nice it's nice um in nice condition the dress is now i may swap it for the dress i've already got of that because i think my one's not in such nice condition who's next rosie oh yeah she has got gems in her eyes she's got like stars in her eyes hasn't she it says 1978 on her head so that's a head mold anyway let's show her to you and you can decide yourself um yeah i've no idea who she is she came in this white dress with red spots on it it does need a wash they all need a wash i always wash dolls from ebay and then yeah she's got her fringe stuck up she does have a fringe yeah her hair's i don't know whether that's been cut well i hope it's been cut i hope it didn't come like that yeah her hair's a bit uh taffle but as i say i only paid 22 pounds for this bundle next we've got her she is a mattel doll look at that face she's got an unusual face hasn't she uh she has got like a strawberry blonde hair she's got pink eyeshadow an open mouth smile and she's wearing this dress i don't know who she is i don't know whether she's in her right dress but she is a Mattel doll, so that's her. Now, what does it say on her head mould? I think it's 1998 it says on her. I'm not sure though, I could be wrong about that. But yeah, she, she has bend and snap knees, but no articulation in her arms or anything. She's a pretty doll though. Who's next, Rosie? Oh, we know who she is. She is a Hasbro Cindy doll. Um. I assume she's a Hasbro Cindy anyway. She's definitely a, a Cindy. She's in quite nice condition. Her hair does need a little bit of a brush. She is missing her um, tiara. You can see where it's been stitched into her hair or missing whatever hair ornament she had. But she does have her Swan Lake-esque ballet tutu and leotard on. And she has got her little ballet shoe so she's nice isn't she she's a pretty doll I bet you know like her oh yeah she's, she's got a pretty face. face and she's got roses on her ears i do think i already have her she's got this gorgeous crimped hair look at that i love crimped hair she has bent arms with a hole for a ring she's wearing this um dress with a belt on it and these like little pedal pusher type leggings um yeah these rose earrings i've seen those i'm sure and i'm sure i've got her she might be the blossom one it says mattel 1991 on her head so she's got a 1991 head mold open mouth smile and then on she's got the twisty waist and the bend and snap knees and it says mattel incorporated china on her back oh hold on a minute she has a button i found a button on her back i'm not sure what it does though let's see oh and she does have a thing for battery so she probably talks oh no but we don't know because her batteries aren't working but that's her love her hair so much she's just beautiful maybe i didn't have her after all then it was these earrings that um made me think i'd got her i'm sure i've got a doll with those earrings in beautiful face though look at that lawrence i'm i'm hoping you could give me a few tips on who these are please lawrence is really good at um identifying barbies uh, <laughs> <laughs> rose is good this one is really well articulated look at her she's got a pretty face as well look and she's got articulation in her elbows in her knees in her ankles she's got little ballet shoes on She's got on these tights, uh, her leotard and tutu. Yeah, she's lovely. Again, I don't know who she is. It says 1976 on her head mould. 
and now I know that that doesn't mean that's when she was made that's just the head when the head mold was made and then she's got 19 90 I think three on her body mold and again that's just when the body mold was she has her little tiara on that seems to be attached to her head yeah it does seem to go all the way through so yeah she looks like a ballerina because she's dressed like a ballerina and she's got ballerina shoes on so that may be her original outfit especially as she has this it seems to be stuck in her head so really pretty face with the greeny blue eyes though who's next rosie oh yeah she's got a bit of a now i don't know whether she is like the my first barbie or something like that she's a more vintage doll she is losing some of her hair at the side here um yeah she doesn't have any markings on the back of her head but i think you can see that the markings are inside the rim of her neck which tells us that she's an older doll i can't actually read what it says to be honest um on her back it says philippines 1976 is it and it says 1986 on her body mold and rosie says 1976 so, on her head mold yeah yeah so that's her i don't know whether she's like i say I was thinking maybe the my first bar. I could have got that wrong. You know me. I've no idea really. I get it round my neck all the time. Anyway, <laughs> that's her. She does have room for a ring, which is missing, and she does have pierced ears. But yeah, she's lovely. Really like her. She's another pretty doll. Look at her. She's a really pretty face. Um, one of the older ones again with the information on the rim of her neck. The dress, I don't know whether it's original to her, but it is a pretty little um, dress. No bend and snap in the knees. Her dress does up with studs and on the back of her body, it does say Philippines 1986, I think. You can't believe me when I tell you because I can't actually read it properly. I'm guessing that they look similar to that on the back. That's what it looks like to me yes <laughs> rosie can tell better than i can but that's her yeah she looks like one of the like she reminds me sort of like the peaches and cream one or the one that comes in the pink dress maybe who's next rosie oh well, we know who that is don't we i think so who is she i think i've got her name esmeralda oh yeah from the hunchback of notre dame and she is in lovely condition as well she has a dress, her dress even still has the little tiny bells on the end of the waist tie. Yeah, she's she's in lovely condition. She's a really pretty doll. Look at that. The hair's nice, it just needs a bit of a brush. It's that really soft, fine Kanekwani hair. So that's her, and then we've got another Barbie she might be in her original outfit or original shorts anyway she has like a white pearly some white pearly earrings in no hole for a ring she's got bend and snap knees lovely that really fine soft hair again she's got stars in her eyes little white the highlights of her of her <laughs> The highlights of her eyes are actually stars. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, she's got like little stars at the bottom there. And then it says on the back of her head. Can you read what it says, Rosie? I can't actually read that at all. Um, 1976 Macau Inc. Yeah, no, so 1976 head mould. And then she's got the twist and turn waist and i think that's 1986 body is it 1966 oh 1966 body mold so 66 body mold was it 76 head mold i think 
So that's her. She's in nice condition. Her hair is super, super soft. Yeah, I got this bundle because I thought it was such a great price. £22 for all these dolls. And then I got this one. She is the oh, something like, uh, what do you call it? Scuba diver. Yeah, she could be the scuba diver one, couldn't she? But she's got the black shimmery legs. Is she the one that comes with a little whale? I'm not sure whether she is or not. She's got her tank on her back. She's got this scuba mask on. She has quite large pink earrings. And as I say, her legs are painted black. They're like black glittery. And then she's got this swimsuit on. So that's her. Her hair is really soft as well. And we're still going. We've still got, how many more have we got? Three more? Four more? Wow, I can't believe how many there is in there. Then we've got this girl. Now, I'm not sure, but I think she is the um, Princess Bride Barbie. I could be wrong about that, but her dress is what makes me think she's the Princess Bride Barbie. I, like I said, I could have got that around my neck. Um, can you read the year, Rosie? Um. So she has earrings in, she has space for a ring but no ring. I think she's the Princess Bride one. I could have got that wrong. She's some kind of bride anyway, isn't she? But she does have a beautiful face with purple eyes. Yeah, lovely she is. Then we've got, now I think she's called something like Sparkle Beach Barbie. So she's got one earring, but she's missing the other. So she's got this shell earring. I do believe that's her original outfit. She's bend and snap knees, no space for a ring. And then she has this color change hair. I think when you get it in warm water, it changes color. That's what I believe. And she's got glitter in the other side. Yeah, so she's another nice doll, isn't she? This one's dressed in this dress with a black top that says Barbie on it. I don't know whether these outfits are original to them. These these one, this one's had a bit of a chew on her. Somebody's had a nag on her foot. Um, I don't know who she is. She's got the how big are your fish hands. How big are your fish? Mine's this big. Yeah, a bit of fibbing going on there, Barbie, I think. Um, Mattel 1976 on the body, five or six anyway, and then on her back it's the 1966 body mould, I think, I think, it's no good asking me because I don't really know, but that dress is nice, it's nice quality, it's even got pink velcro to match the dress look. Yeah, she's a pretty doll, but I'm not a clue who she is. I mean, I, I think if I searched hard enough, I'd find out, but yeah. And then finally, the last doll in that massive bundle is this one. Now, I think she must be Mal is she Malibu Barbie. I say that because she's got this little necklace on and these earrings. She might be the Malibu one. Um so she's got both of her earrings she's got a necklace tied around her neck uh, if she is the malibu one this is not her top and shorts but they do look to be matching and they are a nice set those were all the dolls and we've still got a bag of accessories to show you so let's show these accessories rosie bag dresses, bag dress oh yeah <laughs> um but i mean honestly you couldn't go wrong for what we paid for them and then there's, yeah, there's a whole bag full of these dresses. I've bought some of them before. They're made of very thin fabric that's a bit like paper. But it's nice of those to be added, wasn't it? Then we've got another bag full of, it's got coat hangers, it's got earrings, it's got brushes. Yeah, yeah there's headphones, there's combs, there's all sorts in there. Wow, there's tiaras, all sorts there is. Yeah, even a pair of glasses there, look. And there's shoes and bags. Yeah, let's have a look at these. So we've got, I don't think any of these are original Barbie ones. They don't look to be. So we've got a whole bundle of little plasticky bags, haven't we? 
Is that, is that a bag you've got there? Shoes. We've got this one that snaps in half. <laughs> yeah, that's from a, a, a cheapy doll, isn't it? But still, it's nice that they were added. We're not going to complain, are we? And there's that one that looks like a bow. There's that little purple one. There's that little, another little blue one and another little purple one. This pink one, which I think is Barbie. I do think I've seen that one in a white, probably. We've got a pair of skates, pink, green skates with pink wheels. We've got a little pull along trolley. We've got these red boots. Rosie's got the other one of them. We've got these gold shoes that look a bit like Ever After High, but I do think they are Barbie. We've got some ballet shoes. Orange heels. Pink heels. These green heels. There's lots of shoes in here. Uh, blue heels. We've got this little yellow bag, white trainers, I think they're all pairs, these pink heels, these yellow ones, I like those with the stars on, they're nice aren't they, um, these paler pink heels with a rose on the front, I think these green ones there's a silver pair I'm still going there's a silver pair there they're quite nice and there's this pink pair um, I think oh no there's a flat pair here as well a little flat pink pair I think that's it for the shoes I think I've showed you all the pairs and then we've got this little well it's broken isn't it I don't know what it is it must come off one of the bags oh no there's this blue pair of shoes and I think that green pair so that was our dolly haul for today I hope you enjoyed that thank you for watching bye for now